Hi, welcome back to Food Travel Shopping Channel and you're watching Restaurant Remake and today I am going to be doing a chicken noodle soup and this is an all-time favorite for everyone. Um, you may order your chicken noodle soup at your local diner or you know any restaurant uh, for lunch or dinner and it's such a comfort food, right? Um, even when you're sick, people said, you know, you know, make some chicken noodle soup, you know? So I have all the ingredients here and I'm gonna show you how to get started with this chicken noodle soup. And of course, I am using my four quart stove, La Cucotte. And if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, click the subscribe button below. Also hit the bell notification for our latest video and update. All right, let's get cooking. Okay, these are all our ingredients for our chicken noodle soup. I'm actually reusing for the chicken a leftover ro rosisserie chicken. So if you have something like that at home, this is perfect to make a chicken noodle soup out of it for the next day. And you don't get bored with, you know, what you have. You don't have to eat the leftovers. So we're just transforming the leftovers. Now, of course, you can use some fresh chicken as well, but why not use some leftover to make a soup? All right, first of all, we're gonna boil our water to make the pasta first. We're gonna add in some salt, Just drizzle some olive oil. All right, once we bring the water to boil, we're gonna add in our egg pasta here. Okay, we're gonna cook it for five minutes. All right, give us a couple of stir here. All right, so let's remove from the heat and we're gonna strain it. All right, run it under cold water. So we're gonna stop cooking the pasta immediately. And right now the pasta is not too al dente yet because we're gonna put it in our soup and we don't wanna overcook the pasta if you want to have a nice uh, texture when you drink the soup with the noodles, okay? Let's throw it back into my bowl here. And finally, I'm just gonna drizzle some olive oil so that prevents from sticking. All right, so not too much. So about half a teaspoon to two teaspoon is sufficient. So we're gonna set this to the side. Now we're gonna go back to our soup. I'm gonna add in one tablespoon of olive oil here. All right, we're gonna put in our garlic first. I'm gonna add in our onions, followed by our celery. And our carrots. All right, we're gonna cook the vegetable for three to four minutes here into our pot. Okay, we're gonna season it with some black pepper. Okay, we're gonna season it with some salt. All right, if you wanna add a little bit more pepper, black pepper, do that right now. All right, right now you can see the vegetable is now releasing its liquid, so that's good. You wanna keep sweating it down. All right, give it another two minutes here. All right, at this stage you start smelling all the onions, the celery, and the carrots. It smells really good. And you can see that there's not a lot, whole lot of liquids coming out anymore. So this is where I'm going to add in my chicken. All right, you want to mix well and combine everything. All right, I want to stir the chicken for a minute once you combine them. All right, now we can add in our chicken stock. All right, so with the residue from my cup here, 
I am going to add a little bit more water. Basically, you're just gonna add a little bit more water just to rinse out all the concentration of the chicken broth here. All right, this is where we're gonna close the lid and we're gonna let this boil for simmer for 20 to 30 minutes. So we're gonna do this in a low medium heat. Okay, so let's take a look at our chicken noodle soup here after half an hour of simmering. All right, smell really good. All right, so this is the time where we're gonna add in our pasta, the noodles, the egg noodles. Just break this off a little bit. So after cooking it, it's gonna stick a little bit. All right, and then we're just going to bring this back to a boil here. And we're just gonna continue to cook the pasta a little bit. Remember, I did not fully cook the pasta. So when we bring it back to a simmer, this is going to be perfect. I'm just gonna close the lid and bring it back to a boil and then we're ready to serve. Okay, so let's open our pot and see the results of our chicken noodle soup. All right, so of course, when you cook at home, you have a lot of, you know, chicken, a lot of um, all, the, all, all the stuff, you know, that you put in the soup, you know, not, not like when you go out and they're gonna give you more liquid than actually the noodles and the chicken and, you know, the salary. So definitely these are the things that you can control at home. And that's what I like about cooking at home. All right, so just to finally top it off, I'm gonna put some parsley on top and just dry parsley. Let's try out my chicken noodle soup here. Okay. Now I normally, if you can ask Shan, I normally don't eat the chicken noodle soup outside the restaurant. So I'm really anticipating my version of the chicken noodle soup. All right, so let's give this a try. Mm. I think I do enjoy having the chicken noodle soup at home rather than at the restaurant. Just because at the restaurant there might be too salty. Sometimes it's too salty for me. Mmm. Very light and very... So I'm glad that I made this soup because Shan really loved ordering the chicken noodle soup at the restaurant. And now that I make it at home, I feel like she will be thrilled with my chicken noodle soup here. All right, so I hope you enjoyed this episode on the chicken noodle soup. And I hope that you will actually make it at home and serve it to your loved one. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned for our next video and update. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button for me and hit the bell notification for our latest video and update. Catch you later. See you.